Stephen, it was a certainly an entertaining game. It had everything you would hope from in a derby, but you must be happy with how the game ended. Ultimately, we, we, we set the task of getting three points today, and, and thankfully, we've been able to do that. Would we like to play better? Yes. There's a lot of things that we weren't happy about, yes. But um, the fact of the matter is, we wanted three points, especially off the back of the last two draws, and, and for us to score later on in the game is testament to how our players go about it and that never say die attitude. And togetherness, thankfully, got us a goal at the right time. We've seen a few times this season, especially at home, where we've won quite convincingly and played some pretty football. Is it pleasing for yourself that we saw the other side of that today where we had to grind out the result? For sure, and, and listen, you have to sometimes credit mm -hmm. the opposition for that and, and it would be wrong of me not to say that Inverness played a really good game today and they were they were right up for this derby and, and, and we sometimes struggled to deal with their movement in the middle of the park and the, and the wide players coming on off the side and, but we stuck to a task and we and it wasn't pretty, you've already said that, but uh, ultimately it was about three points today and, and sometimes you need to win ugly and today was definitely that. We saw yourself in shoot as well, I think we ended up with four strikers at the end of the game there. Was that, did that show just how much we, we wanted to go on and win this game? Again, it's the, changes are, the, the changes you can the, the, you can live or die by them and, and we just felt that listen, there'll be one opportunity in the game and if we could get offensive players and we could get strikers on the pitch that if it falls to them we have a better chance of taking it. And thankfully um, a couple of assists for Ross Draper the day but uh, Billy McKay got on the, on the rebound of one and, and then Big Ross comes up with the header at the end. It's, a, it's, it's great for us, it's great for us. And maybe just finally a special mention about that header from Ross Stewart, it was certainly angled greatly into the corner. It was, and Ross is getting better every week, and he and he's he's got real attributes. We've said it for a couple of weeks now. Uh, we see him getting better and better, and and for him to now be chipping in with the goals that he's chipping in, and, and scoring in big games, which is important for strikers as well. Um, we're delighted for him. Um, it wasn't ideal that again we had to make a change early uh, in our back line. Uh, we're just struggling to get that consistency. He uh, uh, boys getting through games and in that area of the pitch, and I think a special mention to Tom Devosti as well for coming on in a in a cauldron of an atmosphere like that and and playing way above the, the his, his actual natural years um, and his performance was was also very pleasing. Stephen, once again, congratulations. Thanks.